click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous topic we have discussed about the acidic nature of sulfur dioxide as well as we have also discussed about the chemical reactions of sulfur dioxide. So now in this topic we are going to talk about the uses of sulfur dioxide. So what are those? Let me talk about that in this topic. So friends, in this topic, I'm going to talk about the certain uses of SO2 that is sulfur dioxide. So starting with the first one, that is the liquid SO2 is used as a solvent for dissolving a large number of organic and inorganic chemicals. So talking about liquid SO2, that is SO2 has a capacity to get easily liquefied and that's the reason that the boiling point of SO2 is that is 263 Kelvin. So that means this kind of gas can be liquefied very much easily. So now, this liquid SO2 has a various properties that is it has a capacity to dissolve many organic as well as inorganic solvent and obviously we have understood that is SO2 is the acidic nature and uh, now let us talk about the next point that is it is used in the preparation of H2SO4 and obviously as I've said earlier that is it is used in the preparation of H2SO4 the reason behind that is first SO2 in presence of that is a catalyst that is V2O5 that is vanadium pentoxide along with that of the O2 it will convert the SO2 into SO <clears throat> so there will be a conversion of SO2 into SO3 and that SO3 it will be very much helpful to prepare H2SO4 so not only H2SO4 but talking about the other chemicals like suppose if we talk about that is sodium hydrogen sulfide so in that case also this kind of important chemicals which are <coughs> sodium hydrogen sulfate so even that is the very much important compound that is what we could make or what we could prepare from so2 so that is the thing and now let me talk about the next one that is it is used in the petroleum refining industries as well as sugar industries so even that has a wide application in industries so as to refine petrol and now let me discuss about the next point So having a pungent and suffocating smell, this SO2 is acts like a bleaching agent and it also acts like a disinfectant and germicide. And talking about the next point that is, it is used as refrigerant and can also be easily liquefied. So for that we know that is once it gets easily liquefied, so we can basically convert this so we can use this SO2 as a refrigerant also and once it gets evaporated it can be re-evaporated because its boiling point is that is 263 Kelvin and obviously it can be liquefied very easily. So these are the certain uses of SO2 that is what I have discussed over here. So that's it. So thank you friends for watching this video. I hope I will see you next time. Till then don't forget to subscribe to channel. Thank you so much.